Next question is from Donovan Kirkpatrick. Do I have to hit abs directly for every full body workout or can I rely on compound lifts like deadlifts and squats to work the core and just work out my abs directly once a week? Well, you're an adult. You can do whatever you want. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> when people ask, can I please? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, you can literally, you can do whatever you want. But yeah. you know, okay, look, I know, that's funny. here's the thing with, uh, with deadlifts and squats. This is where the confusion comes from when people are like, it works your core. And then they have studies that show that when you squat and deadlift, that there's all this, you know, muscle activation in the core. Okay, that's true. Your core is very active when you're doing a heavy exercise that's standing because your core has to stabilize your body. But there's also uh, specificity in how muscles uh, activate and work and how their strength is expressed. Okay, so if your core gets really, really good at stabilizing you for deadlifts and squats, that's probably going to come from deadlifts and squats, but your core might not be strong moving through full ranges of motion like a full sit-up right. or a crunch. It's totally different. Now, there's some carryover, so you'll be better than somebody who does nothing at all, but you're not developing the muscle yeah. through. You're just highlighting it, one function. That's isometrics. It. Yeah. Yep, yep. That's it. It's just like, it, imagine if you only did isometrics for your biceps right, or right. only did isometrics for your chest. Like, uh, What's great and, and why there's studies and, and why people, why this is even a conversation is because there is a lot to support. There's a lot of value in that. That's one one of the great benefits of heavy deadlifting and heavy squatting is it's incredible for isometrics for your abs mm -hmm. to stabilize your core with two, three, four hundred pounds on your back takes a lot of isolation strength. But there's uh, there's two other parts there. There's the concentric and eccentric portion of the exercise that's completely being neglected. So it'd be like only doing isometrics for all the other parts of your body and and neglecting the eccentric and concentric portion of every other exercise. Yeah. It's yeah. not that it's it's bad. It's not that it doesn't get some work. Your abs are getting some work, and it's I tell you what, it's better than nothing. Mm -hmm. The guy who you're the guy or girl who squats heavy and deadlifts heavy is better off than someone who does no exercise for their abs, right? So that person is better off than that. But you are missing out on two other parts that are extremely beneficial. Yeah, this myth, or I don't want to say myth, but this idea really came from the, the power lifter segment of the, the lifting mm. community. Because they didn't want to do it. They don't want to do it. Yeah. They don't care. <laughs> Typically, they don't have abs anyway, or they're not supposed to have abs. You know, when you're a power lifter, you're not getting judged on how you look. It's about how much weight you can lift. So a lot of them don't give a shit about, you know, looking really great in the midsection. It's like, how much can I lift? So then it became... Well, why do I need to work my abs anyway? Like, who cares? I'm just, you know, I'm squatting. I'm just stabilizing. I'm good at it. It's all good. Why work my abs to begin with? You still, you also hear power to say things like, why do I need to work my calves? Uh, why do I need to work biceps? Sometimes you'll hear mm -hmm. strength athletes say, you know, if you train muscles fully, it's better than you if you don't. That's all. So it's a little bit, it's going to be better if you train it right. fully than if you don't. But uh, is it, are you going to be okay if you only hit your abs? You know, you know, once a week, yeah, you'll probably be fine. It's not a big deal. They're just not going to be as developed, or you're not going to have as, 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 you know, full development of the strength curve and all the strength, you know, factors with your abs. Mm -hmm. Just not going to be as good. That's all.